All right, what you're gonna see with this young dog, we just started working with this dog today. It was bumping and chasing birds. It hadn't been trained yet. We started on it today. I'm to the point here where we're check coding the dog, showing it the new strategy of being stealthy and decelerating when it smells birds. This particular scenario, there isn't much wind, it kind of quit on us. Dog was being check corded so I can show it what to do. It went up there and got the scent all of a sudden. Real nice stop, real quick stop. Then I said, all right, and that's our cue for the dog to flush the bird but not chase. I'm showing it with the check cord right now. It glows in that bush, a nice aggressive flush, just like I wanted. The bird comes out, Reagan goes bang. Okay, the dog wanted to go on it. I held the dog there to wait as Reagan brought it back. We're showing the dog that's a team. We're gonna bring that bird back to you for right now, for the next couple of birds, that's what we do. As soon as Reagan gives the bird back to the dog, I turn the dog loose, okay? The dog is free to do what it wants. This dog had been chewing birds, and that was one of the issues the owner had. He chews birds when he chews birds. Wanted me to fix that. So what we're doing here now, the dog finds the bird valuable, so this dog likes to bury the birds, and that's good. He does a great job on burying birds. It shows me that he finds the bird valuable. Tomorrow, we won't allow the burying anymore. We'll have the dog bring it to us and share it with us. The burying goes away. That's part of just a dog. He didn't want to bring it to the owner because the owner's been taking birds. That's why he was being hard mouth because he only has a few moments with the bird before the owner's going to take it. So now he's still trying to keep it away from the owner, but now he's burying it, okay? And tomorrow we're going to show him that, hey, we'll have a check cord, we'll bring him in, he'll give us his bird. And on a bunch of them, when he brings the bird to me, I will then give it back to him and let him do whatever he wants with it. And that's the important part that we're sharing it. He realizes, bring it to me and we'll share it. All right, we're going to check cord this young pup into a birdie area. Dog's already understanding to be careful. Don't want to flush anything. Loose check cord as much as I can. I want this dog making choices. I'm not telling a dog what to do here. I want to see this dog get in a birdie area and decelerate, stalk, and point until I say okay to flush it. There it is. I'll send Reagan out. Here we go. All right, all right, good dog. Okay, Reagan's gonna go get it and bring it back. Loose check cord, I want the dog steady on this as Reagan brings it back. It's hard to get it loose here, but it's loose. Reagan's gonna bring it back, give it to the dog. And now we're going to drop the cord and watch this dog bury its prize. It's going to look for a soft spot. That'll work. Eh, there's better spots. That's a better spot. The, whole, well, the hole's kind of dug there, but I'm going to shake. I'm going to find my new spot. <laughs> it's got to be a better soft spot here. That look, that's the spot right there. Nah, it's a little hard. Well, I'll keep going. I'll, dig a, I'll just dig a, a small hole. Got to bury it with the nose, tamp it in. Push it in with the nose. Good work. Girl. All right.